another MM ASMR video. Today I'm gonna be sharing you my Game Boy Advance collection that I have in this blue shoe box for many years that I've been having. Let's open this up and see what kind of games we have. Okay, so that's an ugly uh, intro. So.
Mario game for the Nintendo Entertainment System. 
is my first, first ever Game Boy Advance game. I know it doesn't, it's just a plain cartridge, right? But this game is Super Mario World. It's basically like the remake of the Super Nintendo one, Super Mario World. This was the first game I've ever gotten, and the first one that I ever played in Mario games for the handheld, I guess. I don't know why, but at that time, I had the urge in peeling off this sticker. I know for a fact I didn't peel it off, peel the whole thing off. I only peeled it off like towards a U shape. I think my brother was the one who peeled the whole thing off. But I don't know, I just had that weird feeling or sensation like having to peel off this particular game off the sticker. And uh, yeah, that was pretty much it. And I know for a fact when I was um, like in middle school, I think someone else had this game as well, but their sticker also was peeled off. So I don't know if it's like a habit or I don't know. But yeah, this game, I got this at a mall as well. And, like, again, this was the first one I've ever gotten. The first Game Boy Advance I've ever gotten. So this is the first one I got, and this will forever be my first favorite game ever. Super Mario World. I should write it down, but I know for a fact this one is the Mario game. Okay, another game, Jimmy Neutron. This game is also broken because... Part of that other game, it was it Rayman? Yeah, this game that my friend gave me that was also flooded because I remember she gave me this one as well. So I don't know what this game is about, and it's and it's broken. So, oh well, I don't even know why I even had these games, but you know, they're just cool to have, you know. Yeah, Jimmy Neutron. Okay, I've been seeing this one a lot, so let's go with this one Donkey Kong Country for the Game Boy Advance. I personally did not want to get this game in the Game Boy. I want it in the Super Nintendo. Do I have that game for the Super Nintendo? No, I do not. But I plan on getting it sometime soon. Not right now, but all I have to deal with this one. I think I have this one in the Game Boy Color as well. I have to double check. But Doggy Kong Country for the Game Boy Advance. It's a fun game. It's just like a Mario style game.
she noticed that I was playing a whole new game, but then I had to lie to her that it was the same game. But anyway, this game brings back a lot of memories. I love the scenery, I love the music, I like the battles, I like the enemies, I like everything about this game. It's just so nostalgic, like this game is my forever, forever number one game. And if I, and truthfully, I think about this game here and there till this day, believe it or not. I would hum to the music. I would like think of like the sceneries of this game. This game is like my top one favorite. I know it's kind of weird. This game came out like in 2003, and it was at that time I got it the same year. So yeah, I'll never forget the day I got this game. This was like I think also the time that we were transitioning to a new apartment as well. Yeah, it was the time. I back to, well not moving back, but like moving to another apartment, but yeah, my original Mario and Cheese Superstar Zago, from all the way back in 2003, kept well and safe, and the sticker is still here, surprisingly, it's just like kind of moisting up here, I don't know why, but yeah, my favorite game of all time. It's basically the same thing as Namco Museum, but as I call the mini arcades. Well, I don't even know why I have three of them. It's kind of weird. Where's the other one? Yeah, I don't even know why I have three of them. It's kind of strange. But yeah, same thing.
Madness, Pac-Man, Maze Madness. I don't even know what this game is about, too, but I assume it's like the old classic Pac-Man style game. There's some games I've never even played, and I don't even know how I got them, but, and, you know, and this is one of them, so, yeah, alright, Pac-Man game. And, well, I guess that's the end of it. I don't have anything else except for this thing, whatever this is.